Okay, meantime, Wisconsin's tourism industry taking a big hit right now. New numbers show that they've lost nearly $650 million in travel spending just over the past month. It's a pretty big number. You might be wondering when you're going to be able to book your next family trip. Our Christina Laurie is joining us with some advice this morning. Hi, Christina. Hi, Leon, Chris. Many of us have the travel bug one month into quarantine. Travel Wisconsin is seeing a 100% increase in requests for its online travel guide compared to this time last year. And according to a new study by Visit Milwaukee, 70% of Wisconsinites are still planning trips in the next six months, up from 65% last week. While it's nearly impossible to predict an exact date, it'll be safe to pack up and leave home. If you've got the itch to plan something, the folks behind Travel Wisconsin say you your best bet is booking a road trip for sometime later this summer or fall. They're calling 2020 the year of the car and expect regional travel to spike, which is welcome news for Wisconsin tourism industry. Last year was the best year on record for state tourism with record increases in the total number of visitors and visitor spending. But so far this year, Travel Wisconsin has pushed back its summer ad campaign. You might have noticed there aren't any ads promoting trips to the Dells or Door County airing on TV right now. Instead, Travel Wisconsin's website has been updated with a number of interactive resources like sweepstakes and virtual adventures across the state. I put a link to those on our website. They're really neat. The hope is that these efforts will put Wisconsin on Traveler's Must See list once it is safe to travel again. We still don't know exactly when that will be, but there are a few signs you should watch for, which may indicate travel will start up again soon. I'll talk about those at, at 530. Chris and Leah. All right. A lot of people itching to get out. Thank you, Christina.